Hi, I'm Dennis Slater, president of AEM. I want to talk a little bit about the uh, highway bill that uh, is in Congress today. What you have right now is they did an extension through May, but it's a short-term extension that really gets us to fund the program for a few months. The key now really is for the for Congress to sit down and find a solution, find the funding for a long-term five or six-year bill that has to really be crafted before May. So we're not really uh, excited about what's going to happen between now and the end of the year or in the lame duck session, but we feel though that the start of next year they will get serious about it. There's really been a sea change in Congress right now. There is an interest in finding a solution. They really understand that the hybrid bill is important to our economic prosperity. So we see something happening there, but it's still going to take a lot of work to find the right funding mechanism for that. The federal government has really struggled right now with getting a highway bill for a long term. The states have had to really bear the burden of trying to finance things to get work done, at least create some certainty in their state to finance it. So what you've happened, and, and Wisconsin is a great example of that, but right now they have a, uh, a voting ballot here that will basically say we can no longer raid the, the highway trust fund in the state of Wisconsin, and that's very important. So I think what states are doing now is they're passing their own funding. They're passing their own user fee increases to help finance roads. And I think that's going to continue until the federal government really gets a long-term plan in place. And even I think after that, the states will continue to invest. So very encouraged by the grassroots support out there and hoping the federal government does the same thing.